Hello guys, welcome back to part 7 of our Planet Zoo series on this channel. I hope everyone's been uh, keeping well. Um, anything interesting going on in your lives? I want to know about it. So, let's get started I guess. Straight in. The usual rewards. And that is Cassie. Oh no, it's Tilly. Hello honey. I swear, every single time I start these YouTube videos, one or the other, an animal or someone comes in my room and today it's the dog. I am home alone at the moment um, and I just took Tilly, the dog, for a long walk and I think she wants some company, so she's in my room. Yeah, it'll, it'll do. You, yes, you're a good girl, aren't you? Right, let's go straight into it. So I think... For this one, I, I mean, I we'll see how we go, but I feel like I want to kind of sort out the flamingo area, get that up and running and making it look a little bit more, like, sophisticated. Is that the word that I'm looking for? Because right now, these guys haven't got much going for them other than water and a bit of a weird rock scenario going on. Bongos are about to have a baby. And we've got the guests think that the uh, tickets are underpriced, which considering how well we're span expanding now, we'll make that to seven and then we'll make that to five and we'll see how that goes. Mechanic has done some research. Yes, not far to go with the drink one now then. That's lovely jubbly. Right. Let's get some, some sunlight in here. Oh, and there it is. Straight into the water, I swear. Every time you just put water anywhere, they just love it. Every animal loves it. Oh, I'm... What is going on? There we go. Oh, I thought my uh, computer was like twitching out then or something. I was like, what? Okay, so... We seem to be doing really well. Money-wise, we're doing good. We definitely need to, like, I am just ready to do some bits and bobs here. Um, But I just need some sunlight. Because it looks very dreary right now. Like, there's some action going on over here. But again, there isn't too much going on. We definitely want to make it a little bit more exciting. Oh, we've got a spider that's died. Right. And we've got a snail, so we need a male snail. Oh, let's slow that down a little bit. We need a male snail. Male snail. And there's none. God damn. Okay, fine. And we've just had some babies. Captive, captive, captive. So we need, yeah, a male spider as well. Oh! There we go. Right. What did I... No, I needed that. Let's, let's look at the, the spiders and see if there's any. There we go. Spiders. Straight in there. Right. I guess we'll just wait. We'll wait. I think that's what we'll have to do. Flamingos, we've done the first lot. Oh, the flamingos are about to mate! How exciting. We need some more hard shelter in here as well, don't we? I've got lots of things to do today so I, I mean what I, what I'll do is we'll do us like a normal time lapse of me sorting out this um, scenery and then if it's too slow then we'll speed it up um, in another one but uh, let's get started with this making this area like 
a little bit more of oh god what is going on with this why is it like going to the floor position snap I think that must have been Jamie experimenting. I feel like they are just about on the water and I want them just under. There we go. Oh, sugar. Like that. That'll do. And then we'll do like another one close by, like here, do one there, and here, just making it like kind of feel a little bit like there's something to this, this area. Not that it's like boring. Like water's water, but we want some sort of definition to it. I want to look at the this picture because I kind of like this. I don't know if there is those flowers though. Could be wrong, but I don't think they are. Are they conning me right now? So let me just have a look at, so let's put these on. Aquatic, oh, okay, so we do have, oh, we have these. That'll definitely do. So let's just put aquatic on right now and focus on making this water look a little bit more exciting. because we want it to look really, really pretty. And just, we don't want too many, but we just want it to look kind of cool. Definitely need some of these around because these, I think these would look good, like down this path way towards towards the waterfall that we're gonna definitely attempt to do because we're all about attempting things with me for sure I do love doing this sort of stuff, but I have to be like in the mood for it, if that makes sense. Does that look cool there? It's like. Let's turn it around maybe. I think that looks cool there actually. I just want it to feel like more homely for the actual animals. That's 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 the aim that I'm going for because, you know, they're the ones that have got to stay in here. <laughs> they're the ones that, 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 that have got to put up with this. I feel like, again, I think that's a little bit too big and I kind of like, I kind of prefer these. What I'll probably do as well is maybe do like some rocks around here as well. I think that would definitely be cool. I think we should do some of these here for sure. Because we don't want it to just be that main area. kind of leading it towards the other area. I 
maybe we'll do a few of these as well. Just little ones. Because I can still swim through all this stuff, but it's just... You don't want to over, overly do it, if that makes sense. I think we could definitely do with a tree there. We want to kind of stick with these kind of trees around this area because they're like the aquatic ones. What else have we got? I think that looks kind of cool so far. I feel like we need to like press play and get some more sunlight in because it's not far from it. There we go. It's much better. I was basically doing that in the dark. Still quite kind of very. Can I change the colour of these? Yes, I can. I didn't know if I could or not. I don't know if making them. That looks better, actually. I just think the black kind of looks a bit dreary. And I'll probably move those as well. Um, okay, so what else do they like? So tropical. Tropical. Grassland. Okay, I think that's good. Uh, okay, so I feel like this, let me have a look at this again. I just want to get an idea. I feel like there's not a lot of grass going on here and I think that's why I'm kind of struggling. But I kind of like the idea of the palm trees and stuff in this. So let me see if I can get more grass with these guys. Hopefully they'll be okay with it. Okay, we got too much. So let's do. And then they just need a little bit more soil. Let's slow that down whilst we're doing that. There we go. Okay. Hopefully that'll be a little bit more better. I think so. Okay, so let's go back to the nature side of things. Actually, these are... I love doing these around uh, these areas. Uh, I've done like an Asia-themed um, zoo before. And I really like doing those. So I think that could definitely work. Oh, what? Like, I want. Oh, these are cool as well. And those are cool. I want these sort of trees, palm trees, but there isn't a ton of them. So. I thought there would be more. Maybe I'm missing it. Am I missing it? Okay, maybe I'm not. I don't know. Anyway, anywho, what we could do here is sort of wedge these around the area. So, I I can't remember how I did this last time, but I basically just kind of filtered these in. The way that I did it last time was a lot more better because I had like um 
a little bit more I had a little bit more of like height to it so I could probably do a ton of this further around but it's just cool how it kind of peeks through and stuff because you don't always have to have the whole the whole thing out like I kind of like to make it like the rocks how you do rocks and stuff that's how I kind of like to do this stuff Just kind of filtering, filtering it in here, there, and everywhere. So you could definitely put some around this area, around here. So like the flamingos can sort of like be on the edge of that. Same with this area. definitely do with something down here as well turn that around just to make it a little bit more different could definitely like put a tree or something around here as well go lower down here as well because it's a little bit more shallow in this area okay it's definitely coming along I'm liking the look of this so far I'm definitely I hate when you get like trapped in the water didn't want to go that deep, but I did. Okay, I'm definitely liking this area a little bit more now. Probably do with putting some of these here. Just to bring that up a little bit so the gaps aren't there too much. That's what I was looking for. These bad boys. I think it would be cool if I had a few kind of here up high so you can have like a like shaded area of like palm trees and whatnot and these are cool as well where are they We've got to be here somewhere. I like putting these guys down just to kind of give it more like greenery and stuff. To just give it that feel of like, I don't know how to describe it. Cause like the grass is like really just like kind of boring. And I think the, this like brightens up the scenery a little bit more. And gives it that like sort of extra oomph of green green a wee I don't know why I said it like that I'm so weird kind of makes it feel a little bit more like jungle like as well I guess I wouldn't say jungle like but you get my drift I hope you get my drift down a little bit further I think that will do in that area because like it's just quite a dreary sort of setup and I'm trying to make it green beautiful and just pretty overall pretty I feel like if I had okay um these ones are cool actually. Could definitely maybe do with 
something here for sure is that up in the air like it just doesn't care just a little bit say yeah yeah with your hands in the air like you just don't care I'm plopping these underneath as well I think makes it look a little bit better oh these yes yahas we have got an enrichment there so we'll be careful on that one let's put these further down like that oh got an itchy lip sorry okay could definitely do a bushier area here oh wait okay we can do that we keep pressing the other buttons because i'm trying to press shift to make this like go down let's put some of that stuff here okay it's definitely coming along I think I feel like it'd be kind of nice if we had some more greenery around here, but I'm not quite sure. I don't want to get in the way of the path. And I feel like palm trees there would be kind of weird. I feel like it would have to be one of those sort of trees. Or these actually. Well, this 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 can work. Kind of reminds me of like a cactus. definitely do with some colour right now. I know we've got the pops of red with those other ones but maybe if we could have some of these guys somewhere. definitely look a little bit more colourful okay I feel like I need to put some more of this here only because it looks a bit dreary Let's lead it to this area. Okay. Okay. I think I think we're all good here for the time being. We'll definitely improve a lot more on this throughout, but I think that'll do for the time being. We spent like nearly two grand, so I don't want to keep spending money. So, next, oh, it's got really cold all of a sudden. Oh, no. Sugar. I think we need to get uh, I think we need to get um, another mechanic because when he's working this seems to happen a 
and it's not good. Oh, what now? Why? I'm confused. He's fine getting someone. Let's see if we've got a female spider. Yeah. Was it male or female? Female. Let's just try with this one. Well, it's only one guy. Oh, it's doing that thing again. That's why. Let me... Let's exit to main menu quickly. And then we'll come back in. I, I had this issue before with uh, the exhibits where, like, for some reason, like the zoo keepers just can't get to it sort of thing for some reason uh and i had to like completely get rid of a zoo before because of it so i'm hoping this won't happen there we go i think it might be okay we have got two of them so i'm hoping we'll be okay we definitely need a, another mechanic. Sure. So. These guys are hungry. Okay, I think we might have to. So we've got one, two, three, four. Let's get another keeper in and see if this kind of helps. Fingers crossed it should. Oh, I forgot about that. She's probably taken the animals because they escaped, didn't they? And we've got this guy on this. Okay. Oh, good. Should be leaving soon. Because they're all okay now. Go away. Right, and we've got the keeper on that because he's getting food, so that's fine. So we can unbox these guys now. Oh, unbox all animals. Now that we've fixed the fence. Sorry, guys. I didn't want to have to do that, but I kind of had to. I apologise. What? Oh no, they're getting the food, it's fine. Got that research done. Lovely jubbly. So, fingers crossed these guys. There we go. All good now. Pee off. Go away. We don't need your input right now. Uh, yeah. Bongos. Right, this guy can go. Release to the world. Be gone. Spectre has arrived at your zoo. Okay, we need to get us someone on there and the mechanic. This is where like everything just seems to all of a sudden just just fail which is so annoying but it is what it is i don't think they've had babies yet they were mating but yeah no we haven't got anything just yet so i don't want to get too many of them if they're gonna breed but then again I'm quite happy just having two 
what have we, what have we got two uh, females and two males because then I can just track it but yeah we'll see we do actually need another shelter area here don't we where do I want to put it though I think we'll have to put it around here I think we could do this one. Because at least then it's kind of near. Kind of near the, the uh, where people are going to look. I think I've gone too far. Have we got any uh, enrichments for them yet? Well, we've got the waterfall thing. But I kind of, oh yeah, I forgot to do the waterfall. Where do I want that though? I kind of would want it like here. But I don't know if that's like going to be okay. And it could go here. I think that looks okay. Oh, why is it like that for though? Why does it go like that? Am I missing something here? I'll just bring it back up. There we go. Kind of weird, but actually we can flatten it a little bit. They're about to mate again. Oh my goodness. So exciting. Yes, be excited, girl. There's so much to look forward to in this day. We love it. Water treatment failing. Ah! We're okay. It's fine. We need to do the old... I really wondered what was going on there and then I realised it's the flamingo sleeping... We need to do the uh, waterfall. Uh, no, it's not that. Where is it? I forget where it is. Construction, special effects, there we go. That's probably better. Okay, this is where I really, really fail it. Oh. Trying to make it look natural, lol. Okay, we're not doing too bad right now. <laughs> Let's see how long this lasts. Get off of that. Don't want any of that. Blah. 
across the bloody road. Oh, it did it again. Pee off. Sorry, I'm trying to remain calm. It's just so difficult when doing this. I just, I'm not a massive fan of trying to trying to make this look as natural as possible. Okay. And then... No. Like that. And then that one should be realistically Ah, oh, it's about to have offspring. Didn't even know they were even having baby. Well, I don't know. I'm so far behind now at this point properconfused.com right where's the mechanic we want yeah that's what we want who's having the offspring well not not him okay it's this young lady let's fast forward a little bit oh look Honey, hello, welcome to the world. What are you? You're a boy, we love it. Straight into the water as always. Oh, how cute, and with mum. That is so adorable. Get those little flippers going. Oh, honey. So cute. Oh, I love. That is so adorable. Oh my god, I've just seen how bad that is. Jess. Oh dear. That will have to do for the time being. Right, anyways guys, I'm going to leave it there. I feel like I've probably done enough for you guys. Um, <laughs> enough. So I hope you've enjoyed uh, this uh, series of the Planet Zoo, this part, let's say. Um, again, if there's anything that you guys want or would like to see, then please let me know in the comments below. And obviously, as usual, liking and uh, subscribing to the channel does wonders for me as well. So please, please, please do that if you can. I would love you forever. I hope you all have a good rest of your day and we'll catch soon. Bye.